Hi people, welcome back and this is the second half of Newcastle vs Queen's Park Rangers for the Coca-Cola Championship League match and let's take a look at the formations Queen's Park Rangers is still taking the 4-4-2 and my team is still taking the 4-4-2 Now I've already done one substitution and look at Danny, Danny is doing very badly Any carry is at 73% but I do not want to waste a substitution Peter is already been stretched off and is looking bad for Newcastle let us get the match underway. Whoa! Oh no! It's a penalty! That is a bad one! My goodness, now we are under pressure. Oh, it's a good save by Team Crow! Wow! Team Crow is on the ball. Well, I actually needed to win this game simply because we are at home and during the team talks I actually pressured them even more to to perform to score but seemingly they converted oh Jonas had a clean shot but he's turned over to over the post by Radek Cerny and yes as I was saying I pressured the team and they consider a penalty in our penalty box Samuel was the one Good fling that it did not become a goal, otherwise his morale will be down. Team Crew did very well to save a penalty. Awesome. <laughs> anyway, it's a corner. It's rare to see goals being saved by the keeper through a penalty. Especially when it's Team Crew, his reflexes are not that good. Then he could really force the ball in and no, it's cut off. Oh no, it's a 1 on 1. Good thing Danny Simpson comes to save the day. Jonas, Barazai, oh no, then it could be fouls, free kick given to the opposition, Queen's Park Rangers. Third back, oh, he tries a long shot but it's way over, Team Cruz holding the ball. Now, I, I couldn't bear the Andy Carroll's injury, <laughs> so I sub E Wayne Wolach. Fabius Pancrete is right now on top because he's a striker actually. And I do not want Fabrice Pancrete to be attacking simply because he is his finish is below 10. But he can dribble so I put him as a midfielder instead. Anyway, I have no choice, I have a lack of strikers, so he's up for now for this match. Things are not looking good. But the opposition flunders with the ball and right now Newcastle is holding it. Oh! Fabrice Kanker has a clear shot but he misses. That is why I don't like him to be on to be my striker. I rather him to be my midfielder. Newcastle's ball. Samuel holding the ball. Goofy. Samuel, Kevin Nolan, Danny Simpson, Wade. Kevin Nolan, oh he touched the keeper with a long shot It's different, yes I start with Kevin Nolan for long shots because he has a good um, long shot ratings Then he continues first ball in and no he's cleared off Kevin Nolan, he tries to do a long shot but he's cleared off the defender He tries again and he's well wide Then he tries to do a free kick but no he's defended off the wall and right now he is going to take the corner 72 minutes and it's 0-0 uh, zero, zero. It's cleared off by the opposition defender and Fabrice again tries to throw the ball in But no, somehow somebody touched the ball and <laughs> It is to Newcastle's favour for this corner The ball is floated in and no, it's cleared off Wait, that is Simpson Razai Oh, Terrible right, on the counter attack Oh no, it's passed back to Newcastle and right now Newcastle is having the ball That is Simpson supports but no Oh, this is Barazai. Fouls and it's a yellow card for him. Right now, I'm under pressure because this is my home ground. I'm supposed to win this game. Steven Taylor, Danny Goffrey, the Eddie. Samuel, he throws the boy. What a lousy cross, but Wade comes back in. Tries to cross, but he is defected for a corner. 80 minutes, still at 0 0. Then he go pre the ball in and no, he's cleared off. Kevin Nolan. Oh, Nish! Woo! 
carry Nolan scores from a from long shot, a scorcher from a distance. All right, man. That is why I saw in carry Nolan. I needed more attacking edge for my striker. Simply, um, more attacking edge for my team. Excuse me. Simply because my strikers are you no know, under par now. So Kevin Nolan fit the bill of an attacking midfielder <laughs> by doing long shots. Alright, 1-0. Now we need to protect our lead. The opposition is pressing hard to get back an equalizer. But Newcastle, please hold on. First of all, yeah, no, it's killed off. Oh no! Somebody's injured. I think I don't have any more any more substitutions. Yeah, I have no substitution until I put one striker up. Newcastle is now, is now down to 10 men. And this is a pressuring time. In the death minutes, we cannot concede. Otherwise, it will be an equalizer for the opposition. That is the only striker. Oh, it's a 1-on-1, one -on -one, but he didn't do well. Newcastle wins the corner. Today, that is on Sapa. First of all, eight and no. Oh, it's denied. Wow, the hitter hit the post and it bounces back. Well, we are down to 10 men. There are 4 minutes of extra time. Too many injuries, I guess. Oh, they tried to test the keeper from range, but it's well wide. Barazai, Danny Goffrey, Rulech. Oh no, it's clear for a corner. They go free. No, the boys. Oh, it's fouled by Lisa. Wow, Lisa had a yellow card already. Please do not foul one more time. It'll be nine man. <laughs> Come on, defenders. Come on, midfielders. Do your job. All right, team crew holding the ball. Now I still refuse to play. Time wasting. My philosophy is still to attack. Oh, there's a corner kick. Oh no, it's cleared off. Alright, man, it's a good match. 1-0 <laughs> to Newcastle's favor. Wow, so many injuries this time. And uh, somebody missed penalty, otherwise, they, were, they could have won. Well, let's look at the test stats. Wow, Daddy is, is 7.1. It was 5.5, around range of 5 then. And Kevin Dolan scored the only goal, but he was stretched off again. Anyway, who is the man of the match? Oh, Radek Cerny. Well, he did well to deny my team. And that is all for Newcastle vs. Queen's Park Rangers. Stay tuned for more football action in Football 2010 at RTR Football Manager. Please subscribe to my channel if you like my videos. Signing off. Signing off.